Amanda the Adventurer is back on the channel. You guys told me about all the different secrets and all the different endings that I haven't gotten yet. Let's do this. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome back to Amanda the Adventurer. So last video, we were killed by Amanda, and you can actually see we got one of the three stickers. So I guess there must be three different endings. This was definitely the bad one, because Amanda turned into a demon and ate our heads off. So here we go. You guys were actually telling me that the code from inside the grandfather clock that we found last time can actually be used right here. I don't know if this wasn't here or if I missed it. I'm not exactly sure, but I actually did write down the code. It was 826. So let's see if we can do 826. I hope this works. It should. You guys told me it should work. Flip the thing. Maybe. It looks like it's green. Yes, yes. Oh, we got two things. We got two things. This, I know where this goes. I know where this goes. This goes on the bulletin board right there. Yes. So now we know what color each of the symbols means. And then what was the other thing? The other thing I did not recognize. Is that like a jelly bean? <laughs> Can I eat it? What? Oh, it's a, is that a pause button? Oh, that's why the TV was sparking. It was broken. So if I put that there. Oh, now we have a pause button. I don't really know what we can do with the pause button. Really quickly. By the way, if you guys want to see more Amanda the Adventurer, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel right now. Also, keep telling me in the comments about all the secrets that I haven't gotten yet because these are these are very helpful. So I'm pretty sure these colors have something to do with the girl. I need to find the other flower. I don't know. Do they need to match? So that kind of looks yellow. Let's look at all the colors. Are any of them yellow? There is a yellow one. There's also one that's called potato, which is also kind of yellow. So you know what? Let's do... Let's do this one and that one. So basically, those symbols go along with the pots. So is that... No, that's not it, Brandon. Which one? I, I remember one was the moon. So let's look for the moon. That is not it, Brandon. Let's look for the moon. That's the moon. All right, sweet. So basically, if we put this little pot with dirt and we put it under the water... The dripping water should make the plant grow. Oh, it's just making a potato. Oh, I thought the flower was going to be like the color of a potato. Wait, I don't I don't think that's what I needed. Wait, can I even pick it up? I got a potato. I don't... Yeah, I'm def that's definitely not what I needed. May we must need the potato for something later. So you know what? I'm going to put the potato there. What was the symbol for the yellow? It was the one that kind of looks like a two and a four combined. I literally can't find it anywhere. Is it just this one? Is it just the one that was right here? No. What the heck? Wait, where's the where's the one with the two and the four? I remember I saw it last time. All right, you know what? We're going to come back to that. Another thing you guys told me is if I go, I think it was back here. Ah, here is the peach. Now, I th if you guys remember from tape number one, Wooly says that his favorite type of pie is a peach pie. So I wonder if maybe I can make a peach pie? Can we maybe put it in the oven? I, you know what? Let's let's watch the first tape. Maybe we'll get a little bit more information that way. So here we go. Tape number one. Also, now I have the pause button. Hi, I'm Amanda. Hi, Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Hi, Wooly. So I can fast forward. Oh, gosh, I don't remember what they wanted me to say. Wait, what if we say peach? P-E-A-C-H? Mmm, that sounds delicious. Okay. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. Well, we're not making first, a peach pie. Wait, what if I pause... Oh, now I can pause the video midway through. Wait a second. So let me see. If I take the peach, can I maybe... I don't see the pie tin. That's the only problem. Can I maybe throw the peach in there? I don't know. What should I put it up to? Um, I don't know. Peach pies need uh 525 degrees for... uh. 50 minutes. That seems like a very long time, and I'm literally just going to throw the peach in there. Does that work? Close it on up. Wait, I didn't even get it in there. Wait, I didn't even get it in there. Come on. Go in there. Ah, Go in there, man. Come on, you stupid peach. Close it. Close it. It keeps popping out. Okay. I don't think that's going to work. How high does this go? Goes up to 60. All right. I don't think that is working. Let's go back into here. Hmm. Apples. 
Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apple? Yeah, we can use a knife. Okay, I'm just gonna say peach again. We can't use that. No, uh, what if I say, uh, woolly? We can't use that. No, all right, fine. Let's just go knife. Good job. Thank you. Oh, wait, we wait, wait. Can use a sharp knife. Wait, I'm gonna pause it. If you noticed, there was a little symbol on the refrigerator that showed the oven on fire. Wait a second. What? I remember seeing one of you guys said something in the comments. That's kind of why I put the temperature so high. What if we put the temperature all the way up? I think it goes, it goes to 575. All right, let's put it to 575 and let's make it go as long as it can. I think it's 60 minutes. Will that do anything in the video? Oh, look at the oven. Look at the oven. It's on fire. Let's see what happens. Wow. Okay, we just learned something big. We just learned that what we do in the attic actually affects the game in the videotapes. That's actually very big. Ooh, this is new. This is new. What is this? A meat pie. Ingredients, 200 grams of potatoes. We got the potato. 200 grams of mushrooms. We know where the mushroom is. And 350 grams of meat. Ew, that picture doesn't look very good. So it says preheat the oven, uh, 525. All right, let's start doing this. Let's do 525. That is very warm. Okay, and 50 minutes. All right, let's do 50 minutes. Beautiful. And now we need to add, it was a potato, which we have. Wait, how do I get the potato out of the pot? Can I just put it in the pie tin? I don't feel like that's what I'm... Is that... Oh, maybe that's... Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. What was the other ingredient? The mushroom. I definitely know the mushroom is, like, growing... I don't think I would eat this mushroom. It's, like, literally growing out of the wall in my attic. And then the last thing was meat. I mean, this is cheese. That's not meat. Where would I find meat? Oh, wait. Wait, maybe one of the ingredients here is a meat? We've got pale pink, purple, yellow, lilac, potato, beige, blue. No, none of those are meat. Okay, you guys helped me in the comment section again. I went to my last video. You guys said to take the cheese and put it in the mouse trap. I don't know how you guys thought of that. I, oh, I don't think I did that right. Wait, Brandon, Brandon I don't think you did that right. There we go. Mouse? Uh, oh, there. I didn't even see him. Is he there? Is he there? Oh, that is the meat. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is going to be the meat. Oh, this is a disgusting pie. This is a really disgusting pie. We've got a, a mushroom that was growing out of the wall. We've got a potato, including the dirt and the pot. And now we've got a dead mouse that we found eating my cheese. Oh my gosh, I do not want to eat this pie. I really do not want to eat this pie. 325? Or it was 525. Hey, I got a new achievement. Rodent recycling. And we got a new videotape. What is this one called? In your neighborhood. Wait, this is very similar to one that we already have. Let's throw it in the TV. What's this one going to look like? Amanda the Adventurer. Yes, the world's Hi creepiest. There. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Oh. Amanda, maybe some of our friends can come back to the neighborhood? This is different. That's great. I like that there are so many friends in my neighborhood. What? Today, I want to send something special to my friend. Wait, but nobody's here. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? I do know where the store is. So if you guys notice, this is very similar to the tape we had last video, but there's a new store now. I don't think the butcher was here last time. Last time it was just the, the convenience store, the candy store, and the uh, mail store. So what if I hit butcher? I don't need to go there right now. What if I try it again? Do you think this is funny? Yes, I think it's very funny. Just take me to the store. I want to go to the butcher store. Now, can okay. you tell me where I need to go? Okay, so you're, so that's how you're going to do things here, Amanda. All right, let's play through it regularly, and then maybe at the end we can go to the butcher store. Good job. Thank you. Let's go to the store. Beautiful. Let's pick out a card. My friend, something bad happened. This is different. What kind of card should I send them? What was that? Something bad happened? Okay, so last time we did the one with the thumbs up. What if we try the sad one? That's not the right card. No, what about this one? 
I don't think we want this. Oh my god. I think Amanda is confused. <laughs> what? Hmm. I'm confused too! Shh. Here's a secret. It's my birthday. What? Maybe we can help her out. It's Wooly's birthday? Why would we help out Amanda? Wait a second. Another thing you guys were telling me is that these musical notes might actually mean something. I'm gonna take a picture of them on my phone. I don't know how to read music, but maybe I can look it up on, like, Google. Let's see. What do Go I do? Go ahead and pick a card, friend. Okay, let's pick, uh, that one. Are you sure that's right? I don't... That looks like it. I bet your friend is really going to love this card. What? My friend is... My friend... Oh, this is creepy. My friend is having a birthday! I want to get my friend a special treat! Where can I buy a treat for my friend? The butcher well, store! Know. Let's get them some nice candy! Do you know where the candy store is? Okay, you know, we're just gonna play along with her charade here because every time we do, everything changes. So let's go to the Wait, candy store. What? Why did you do that? Now I can't find the candy store. Oh, I don't no. Know where to go? Can you help me? Oh, this is a problem. Well, we're going to the butcher store now. Don't do that. She's getting very angry. I don't want to go there. She's getting really angry. I said I don't want to go in there. Okay, calm down. Calm down. It's not your birthday. It's Wooly's birthday. And if Wooly wants to go to the butcher store, we're going to go to the butcher store. No. Why is this happening? Okay, she's literally going insane right now. I kind of want to pause the video. Is there something we can do... Where's the keyboard? This is the keyboard. Oh, man. Wait, let me look. I want to look up music. I want to look up musical notes and see if it spells something out on the keyboard. Okay, okay. I think I'm figuring it out. So the first letter is an F. The second letter is an A. The third letter is a C. So F, A, C. Then we've got another A. And then we've got a D. And we've got a... What is that letter? E. D E facade F A C uh A D E Oh my gosh that actually worked and I got an achievement called Beethoven Yo we got one of the secret tapes you guys were telling me that there are secret tapes in this game. By the way, the TV looks terrifying right now. You told me about these secret tapes. I'm just going to put it here. I don't think I can put it in until we're done with whatever nonsense is going on here. But we're going to come back to that orange tape. I'm going to hit uh, Butcher again. I'm afraid to see what happens now. She gets more and more angry every no! time. Why can't I stop so sorry, sorry about that, buddy. This isn't the candy store. There is nothing here that I want. Okay, uh, maybe you can take us someplace else? Yeah. I want to get my friend a special treat. So I need to pick one of these things to give Amanda's friend. Uh, we've got either a hunk of meat or another hunk of meat. Hey, Butcher, who looks like Baldy? What do you think I should choose? Okay, I'm gonna choose this one. Let me out of here! Oh, Amanda, that's, that's a nice birthday card. What? You want to give it to your friend now? Is this Will a you symbol? The card? Who should I send this to? Uh, is it is it Kate? Wasn't Kate the name of her friend? Let's go. No, Kate. I don't think it's their birthday. No. What about Wooly? The card is for someone really cute. Really cute? Um, it, it must be my name then. It must be me. Uh, TFG. No. All right. What about um? What about uh, Amanda? Gosh. I guess you really forgot. Did I spell? I think I spelled Wooly wrong. <laughs> Wooly? Oh, Wooly. It's your birthday. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. That was absolutely terrifying. I will be back for more of this game very soon. Also, check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. And I will see all of you in the next video.